All right, let's take a look at this funky graph that I've got here, and let's talk about function notation. Function notation is a shorthand way. It's a it's a very concise way for mathematicians to write. I'm going to say that f of x, the red graph is f of x. And I say it's f of x because it's a function. The red graph is a function of x. So if x is 2, when x equals 2, f of x, if I go up to the line, if I go up to the graph, and then follow that over, that's f of 2, whatever that value is. So 3 f of 2 equals 3. So this point right here is 2 comma 3. When x equals 2, y equals 3. That's what f of 3, I'm sorry, that's what f of 2 actually means. It means what is the function value when x is 2. So see how that, that that's a very concise piece of notation. f parentheses x means f of x, which means the function of x. So what's the function of what's the function of zero? It's gonna be do this one in green. What's the function of zero? Right here, whatever those numbers are. Let's see that's where they were. Five. Go to zero, yep, it's five. Go to zero on your x axis, so there's zero and x. And what is the function value at zero? Five. So f of zero equals five. So what's f? Let's do one more. What's f of uh, negative six? So go to negative six, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. That's your x-axis. So there's negative six on your x-axis, and follow it down to the graph. Negative three, and it's and then follow that back that. over, now, and that's the function value exactly. So f of negative six is negative three. That's how function function notation is utilized to graph and to read graphs.